today's little walk is in Salty Forest in Northamptonshire. And I haven't been here for quite some time and I thought, you know what, I really could do with getting out in the woods. Um, yeah, I miss it. So today I'm just going to go for a little seven mile wander through the woods and from there I'm going to find a nice little place to, to pitch up and make a brew, have some lunch. I've brought my Trangia cooker with me today so I've got some one of these instant meals that you just put boiling hot water into. I'm going to have a little play around with my DD tarp get that set up. I've got my hiking chair with me. Just spend a little bit of time out here with Mother Nature, enjoying the fresh air, enjoying this beautiful green space and see what the day brings. I have no particular plans, no real particular route in mind. I'm just freestyling all the way. So the tarp is up. It has one tie point by the tree and I've used a, a bungee cord rather than paracord because I'm rubbish at tying knots. And I've used three tent pegs to pin in the corners to the ground. And I'm just using um, a ground sheet from one of the tents that I have at home, which is perfectly ample for what I'm doing. Can't say I'm completely satisfied with the setup. I think I do need a lot more practice. I mean, I'm only doing a bit of a sort of a day hike today. Um, I'm only gonna be here for a few hours, but if I was to do a wild camp under a tarp, I think I'm gonna have to rethink that and think about how I can get a bit more practice in. Um, even if I just do it in my garden, I'm not particularly happy with this configuration, but you know, it's all a learning process and at least I'm giving it a go and I'm trying something a bit different. It's about quarter past one now, and it's about one degree Celsius. And I think it's time for a nice hot cup of coffee and something to eat. Time to get the trangier out. This is today's lunch. Naked Big Eat Japanese style chicken katsu curry with long grain rice. It's just a really cheap meal that I bought from the supermarket. Just pour it in and leave it for four minutes. Nothing special. Um, how many calories? 380 calories per pot. Yeah, it's not, not amazing, but it, it will do. It's better than nothing. Cheaper than buying actual proper camping meals. We'll give it a go and see if we like it or not. Mm. We got bubbles, toil and troubles. Let's give this 90p curry a go. Ooh, it's very stodgy. Yeah, it does smell like katsu curry. Let's have a go. Oh, the steam's coming off it now. <laughs> yeah, it's only mild rating. Oh, I'm not very good with spicy foods. Blah. Yeah, it's all right. It was 90p. I'm not going to expect five-star Michelin standard, am I, out in a forest? <laughs> but you know what? It's nice. It fills the gap, as they say. It's not windy at all. 
and if it was raining I would really appreciate this tarp so maybe it's a good idea for me to practice using this in relatively good weather so when the weather isn't so good I feel more confident with it hmm. just a thought and just to add on to that 2022 is a year that the wild camping stabilizers well and truly come off 2021 was very much learning getting used to my kit gaining confidence but now I feel like I want to push myself and do a bit more and that's uh yeah exciting and that's why I'm doing this just to kind of get used to stuff yeah I could have brought my Langshan but it's a bit overkill for a couple of hours in the forest um but I really want to get into tarp and baby camping um and I can do it it's just a question of finding the time to do it right back to the curry now Rachel stop waffling on That's all from me. Thank you for staying till the end. We definitely rocked up and rambled today. Feel free to give it a like, leave your comments below. Any tips and advice you can give me will always be greatly appreciated. And please do consider hitting the subscription button. I will see you on the next one. Look after yourselves. Take care. Bye bye.